Good day, everybody. Hunts here, and welcome back to Endless Space 2, our supremacy expansion he show run through. Hope everyone is enjoying themselves. Don't forget to hit that like, leave a subscribe, and leave comments down below, because you might get systems, heroes, planets, who knows, but something, most likely, will be named after you. So sit back, relax, grab a snack, and don't forget to yell at your screen as we continue our fight against the Fallen. The Unfallen, I should say. We use some key on our behemoth, the Relentless Keith, to defend itself from the next attack. We also got... Beyond the Silver is going to get the Technology Center up really soon. We got the Denerick University being completed at Dorvian, and when this pops out, we'll put that on Dorvian. We are getting some Titanium now, which is nice. We're going to get some more when we get to Uslo. And we're getting close to doing that. And at Zynus as well. So that should be helpful. We're still marked on Colador, but we are going to be building up a fleet around them as well. So that should be useful. And we found out on Cronerside that when we get the... Where is it? The Xeno Tourism, plus three dust per person with luxury deposits, plus one dust per person on planet. So that's four dust! Four dust! Per person, this entire system has luxury resources. So that would be four extra dust, and all this will go up exponentially, which will be beautiful! Also, we can pop and find out what's on Dwarvian 3 in three turns. We somehow survived a massive battle, not sure how, but that should be good around Beyond the Silver. Ooh, I keep forgetting to put that mining probe up. One of our toxic, so that should help. And I think after this, we will be sending our next fleet down to, well, this economic behemoth down to Dwarven to help speed up the Denrick University. But I think that will be it for now. I think we are good. I think we can just next turn. Ah, we got a hero level up. Ah, pink wave gamer. We got some food. We'll do some dust as well. Actually, no, let's go Health Fleet. Battle Silo Cat. We don't need to watch that. It will be a bloodbath. Decisive victory. You got some key. A lot of experience. So that went well. This behemoth's going to heal up, and then we'll go to Rigel. Dwarven got an elo pop. And Draco, alright, you did your desert. Productive logistics, and eh, not really useful. Well, actually it might be, but not at the moment, because we don't get that much titanium in. Let's see, you're only at 8 dust. And you're not going to be growing much. It's really a bleh system, but it does give us access to the Eider, which is useful. Oh, we can move these guys to this planet. So this should give us a lot more food. Eh, not that much more. Let's see what happens when we do Ancestral Home System. All of our production goes... Food goes to the home system. Ah! No, let's keep it as is, because I don't want to lose pop. So what do we do here? 
Well, okay, I guess we'll go militarist propaganda. Because we just want the food to grow. Oh, he found the questionable ship. So we'll head to favor and defend for a turn. Hey, to Dwarvian. Wait, we still have two turns? Oh my. Okay. Can't afford to do that. No, we don't want paid out. Oh, we don't need you there. Alright, that's fine. Ah, we got Zinus. Woohoo! Oh. Yes, we want to colonize the large atoll. Because it has the dust ruins and titanium. Oh, that's a nice looking planet. It has medium all down the line. Three, three, and three. Maybe weak science, but that might change with the life form curiosity. It might change. So, colonize Max in 41 turns, and we gain our food from Dwarvian. Ooh. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. We can afford to do that. Denmark University, plus 10 influence, which will be useful. And then plus 2 fits. All fits on all pops. <laughs> ah, yes, please. That's going to be a lot of population. Droidman's going to be an amazing system. Amazing, as one would say. Actually, I don't know if they would say that. I did. Now we're heading to the forest for all the food and science, and then head to, of course, Corvus 2. Apply Cryogenic, so we'll get the. Blah, 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 the Hunter, which we won't be using just yet. But this war is going better than I thought it would. So that's good. That's good. There we go. And then we're getting the hull upgrades. Behemoth got upgraded too. Plus 7,000 health. And set the module multiplied to four times on Behemoth. Great. Wow, protection. Ship, repair ship after each phase, 10, 15%. What? Okay. And we get the strike class, which we cannot build any of. Ooh. Oh, okay. Some things in this cosmos we have come to understand. You're not one of them. Sure, let's what ask them to remove their fleets. What is your objective? Good, that's good. Where are their fleets? You know, I should have asked where their fleets were before doing anything. We'll take that question out. Go and heal. No, let's, we don't need to repair. Let's edit and see what might be edited.
I thought it was science. Okay. And some defensive capabilities, at least. Salakat got a hawk up. Good. Good. But you can do some defensive maneuvers. Okay, we can start colonizing Uslo. And we'll go for the small Mediterranean. For the Titanium and the Hyperium. Eh, weak. It, the deposit silver, not that strong. But, strategically, that is nice. And it's getting its food from... Dwarven? Oh! Uh, that might not be good. Uh, Dwarven? Yeah, that might not be good. We might want to send in stuff from Silo Cat. Or not! Whoa, why does Silo Cat have not much food? What? Are you saying food's somewhere, Silo Cat? Doesn't look like it? Odd. Foam consumption is 119. Okay. Do we not get any food? Well, this is giving food. Now what? We might... We might not be getting any food. Okay. Intriguing, intriguing. So you did get the kite. Oh, look at this ship. Oh my. Oh, that's terrible. First, let's just go movement. One of each. There you go. That would be useful. Energy damage plus 25%. Critical hit chance plus 15. Yes, please. It's a lot more damage per second. That will be doing a lot of damage. But we won't be building those for a very long time, so we don't have to worry. See, we're at four a turn, six a turn. That's good. Two each. Let's see, Cornerside has this thing going. Yep. Food and the next colonization.
this will be nice next. Because that's going to be 80 production extra. So yes, please. I kind of do want this. Let's get the food. Get modernization for extra 60 science. Wait, this is colonized, but there's no one there? What? Oh, right, we did a uh, population sacrifice. We're losing a lot of food everywhere. Huh. Odd. Well, this will give us, what? Five, ten, fifteen extra food. I'm gonna get that twenty. Well, let's not actually do that there. That should be used on Drake or Evolve. 60 signs from them. We can do that. Still traveling. You're growing. Alright, let's get the production. There you go. Get Dwarven some production. And the mining around this would be good then. You know what? We don't need that Falcon then. Let's just go one Falcon each. Get the Vault of Governance up. So let's pop the Anomaly. Ah, because I cut out and come back and I can't skip. Let's pop this anomaly. Hmm, seismic activity. Ooh, a life form. Let's see what we get. And it's... Oh! Lunar Surveillance Station. Built from endless plans found in an ancient dig site, a lunar surveillance station can greatly boost scientific progress in systems containing moons. Oh! That's nice. And unexpected. Cool. I'll take that. Now, do we have any moons anywhere? No. I don't think we have any moons. Silo can't have a moon. Nope, we have no plants with moons? No, okay. Interesting. There's ruins there, subterranean stuff. Huh, well then. Hey, we found a moon. Oh, we found two moons. Okay, Lonica would be good for signs then. Ah. Oh, that's Zinus. Nope. Cran? Nope. Okay. And our turn. Ah, getting key. Yay. Deed. 
Yes! Be the first to achieve the intergalactic, so now technology is cheaper for us. Colodera has got pirates marked on it. That's fine. EO, he show. Gamers Therapy, you've leveled up. Oh god, yes. That would be helpful. Okay, let's see. What's on Jorbian? See, what are you? A life form. Will it be a useful life form? Nope, just just dust. 100, 450 dust. That's... Eh. Eh. Alright, so go Loka and then uh, Zynus. It's gonna take us a while to get there, though. Our military behemoth is full. So I head to Rigel. Ah. Intergalactic Technology Center. Everything's cheaper now. Yay, cheaper. So I was hoping that would give us something, like potatoes or just something, but oh. Nonetheless, we don't. Yeah, give us the EO of this planet. The... Huh. Oh, that would be useful. Oh, that used a lot of key though. If I had a hundred, that yeah, hundred, I'll get the fealty center up. But definitely get the industrial sectors on, because that gives four extra production each, two extra production each. Excuse me. Ooh, it's actually a good idea. Some specialization going. Now let's just do this on all of them for once. Eh, no. Silo cat. See, corner side doesn't really matter at the moment. 
Let's see, quest log. Let's see. Three hundred sixty-eight production, ninety-eight food on Bjorn the Silver. Well, that should change with this. Two, four, six, eight. Ten extra production. Well, it should be a 98 food. Oh, we're not a 98 food. Oh, okay. So I guess it's food. One turn. Oh, wow. That's cheap. Where are we at? Oh, a thousand signs a turn? Oh. Eh, yeah, food is useful. That's a lot of production. Sure, we'll do that. Uh, you want to stay around cooler door? You get destroyed. I shall defend the faith. I shall defend the faith. Whatever you have, you have as marked. And our turn. And this will be the last turn of the episode. Everything's been going pretty well. I think at least. Good extra food. Meaning the action beyond the silver has ended. So I send our fleet out.
There you go. Four turns. That significantly. Actually, we don't need this. This should be enough. Plus two per person? Yeah. That should help. So we don't get much food. Dwarven does get a lot of food. No, let's... One colonize and one turn. Let's just get that. Potato logistics, yes. Yeah, 60 production. I'll get that all up. And we are. Gaining pop, which is nice. I will see around Uslo. Well, first see what's on the Ash Planet. Subterranean. And it's Adamantium. Nice. Let's see what's in the Ruins. We get Giga Lattes. Okay. That's helpful. We get Giga Lattes now. Oh, pirates have spun around Delphinus. Ooh. Let's head to Ornto, because they're trying to spread their vines. Okay, let's get some armor up on our systems. You have the silver. Yep, that's good. Wow, that's a lot of soldiers. Okay. That's it for today, folks. I hope you all enjoyed. Until next time. Oh, later, alligators.